Hello everyone, welcome to this new edition of Footprints Parent Connect app. Objective of the video is to familiarize with that. Uh, so as soon as you open up that, this is the screen that is going to greet you. It's totally different from previous screen. Uh, here you have a list of interesting and informative articles. Feel free to go through them. If you want to share, you can share it with your families and friends using these options at below. Uh, so at top, you will find there this login button. If you click on the login button, it will ask you for a user ID and password. Uh, give your user ID and password and then click uh, login button. And uh, then this is the screen that is going to uh, greet you. It's the central screen where you have your child's name written at the top, where you have a picture of your child at the bottom. And at center, every day update about your child is listed over here in this section. Uh, you have this more button. If you click on the more button, it takes you to the history of the updates that has happened with your child over a period of time. So you can see all the dates and all. Now let's go back to the main screen. At top, this green button over here. Uh, with a chat icon if you click on it uh, you can send us any messages that you want to and uh, we will revert you back uh, using the same so uh, you will also notice that there are these small uh, icons over here so these are the icons uh, which will take you the main menu so for example in this particular thing we are talking about uh, food that the child has eaten at this particular time so if you click on this uh, icon over here it takes to the food menu so uh, you have uh, your food menu listed over here and uh, uh, this is the date you can click any of the date and you can uh, see the food menu for that particular date uh, let's go back uh, below it you have multiple uh, options uh, multiple places to navigate to uh, first is the food ga uh, photo gallery if you click on the photo gallery it takes you to the photographs which are which we share with you on a regular basis uh, you can click any of the image, you can zoom in, zoom out, or you can also share it with uh, everyone using this uh, Facebook share button over here. Uh, then there is this uh, group area. If you click on the group button, you find two areas. One is the measurement, another is the child care. Measurement is uh, the measurement of the child, like height and weight taken over or taken on this particular date. Uh, we will also have, going forward, we will also have a list, uh, history of the dates over here, so you can see uh, you can track what is the growth of your child over a period of time. Uh, this is the child care button. If you click on the child care button, uh, again, date wise listed, and these are the updates related to uh, the development of the child. If you click on any of it, you get to see a detailed report about what has happened with your child. Let's go back. Uh, and again, let's go back. Below it, there is this bus tracking. This is not yet launched, it's going to come soon. Uh, but as soon as it's launched, and if you have taken up the transport facility with us, uh, you will be able to track where the bus is at any particular point of time. A food menu we have already discussed. Uh, click on it and you get to see the listing of the food menu over here. You can select whatever data you want to. Uh, then there is this activity calendar. Activity calendar is not yet launched. Uh, it's again to come soon. And uh, in the activity calendar, you will have a list of activities that uh, we plan to do. So. Other than this main screen, you will also find that bottom there are multiple screens. Uh, first is the home screen. Home screen is, uh, we have already discussed, a uh, list of the blocks over here. So, then next to it is uh, the CCTV screen. If you click on the CCTV screen, uh, you can access the CCTV. Uh, so, uh, let's say click on one of them. Uh, you can select wherever you want to open it using whatever app, external app. And uh, as soon as... Uh, you click over here so you get to access the CCTV over here now let's go back uh, any other CCTV uh, area that you want to access to you can click over here and access it uh, now next to uh, this uh, the child icon there is another icon which talks about the, which is the footprints uh, uh, logo if you click on it you will see this is the area where we will be sharing uh, school related images not exactly your child related but uh, any school related uh, images that we have we will keep on posting over here uh, below it there is teachers button if you click on the teachers uh, you will get to see a list of all the teachers uh, who are working at that particular center so you can get then there is a parent orientation video tab uh, over a period of time we will be publishing a lot of uh, parent related uh, you know uh, useful videos child care related videos or whatever you should expect out of footprints all these things will come over here invoice is the invoice section where you can access the invoice uh, of a child it will also open up uh, with an external um, browser or something that you can open over here uh, 
one important thing that you will notice is that irrespective of the tab that you are in you will find uh, this footprint support icon over here so any issue or any request that you make want to make to footprint you can do it by clicking on this if you click on it you will find uh, multiple sections one is raise an issue raise an issue will allow you to raise an issue related to this particular areas or you can also make certain requests so issue is a problem that you are facing that you want to resolve to and request is a new request that you want to give like you want to take a break or you want to uh, withdraw your child or transport related uh, request just click on any of the buttons you have to give date reason whatever and then submit it and we'll get that uh, request and we'll revert back to you uh, finally uh, the last button is your profile button uh, where you have all the information related to your child date of birth your name email id and everything uh, and there is this logout button so you click on this logout button and you can log out of the application uh, and uh, this is pretty much about the new app that we have thank you